Hey guys and welcome back to Nemoria. I am Stejo and this is the Holy Slip. Do 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 do. There we go. <laughs> I accidentally uh, got rid of my recording software. Even though it was recording, but uh, it wasn't on focus, so I couldn't see the time, which is bad because I end up with 18 minute episodes like the last one. Ah, uh, right. So 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 so. What's the plans? Survive winter just now. Um. Yeah, that hole's getting dug. That's fine. God damn you, people. Uniforms, left hand, none. Get that dropped right now so that. Lucky I noticed that, it's just probably people running around with weapons that the, uh, the army should actually have. There we go, so now I can uh, be militia, left hand, edit, right. I think we only need another hammer, yeah, that's right. Hmm, I don't know why it's saying that, I think we've got three of each of them. Whatever. I'll just let them do what he likes. Unless it doesn't count as stuff that's actually on people, that would suck though. Oh, something's been made and this guy's legging it to pick it up. Mine! <laughs> no, fight you. In the middle of the bloody kingdom. Just closing areas off. Spaska, how's Spaska doing for equipment? He just needs his body now. Perfect. Means that we've almost got two people fully equipped in bronze. That'll be good. Well, as soon as I'm. Keep checking the tinker because I want guns. I want flintlock pistols so that I can equip my militia with them. Why did you go and get. A strawberry when there's sandwiches in there. They'll probably go in there to eat the strawberry and go and eat a sandwich. Yeah, that's what they tend to do. Whatever. <laughs> if that's what they want, then that's fine. Part of a balanced diet. I mean, you can't live off of fucking bread and meat. You actually can't, guys. So, real life lesson here. Don't try and live off of bread and meat. <laughs> you hear things like, as part of a balanced diet for a reason. Yeah? Yeah, things actually getting done. I'm actually quite happy that uh, the Great Hall is going to be finished instead of being like yellow pretend tables. Oh, I think that's not the noise. I always think that's the noise, but it's not. There's a song that sounds very similar to that. That is the uh, the battle sound song. Do 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 boom ba da dum. I find it interesting that the butcher can run at full capacity like this. Chew. Uh, and he'll still butcher stuff. I find that interesting. Not for any reason in particular, I just, I just find it interesting. Go, he's making more copper. This is good. It was good that the merchant came because we could get some more copper, which means that we can actually outfit our guys. Oh, sorry, just cracking my back. And we need a hammer for this guy. I don't know if the hammer's made yet or not. I doubt it. It doesn't tend to get made before the armor because the armor requires less bars. So they'll make armor first and then weapons, which is fine. I mean, I'm not that much, I'm not that bothered about that. We are, we need more people to eat all the food that we're getting because <coughs> we're getting a hell of a lot of food. I mean, I should probably stop butchering excess livestock and just let the, the yaks roam free. But I mean, I think we've just got too many yaks right now, I think that's our issue. The alpacas are roaming free though, which is not good. <laughs> I think our um, rancher Blaine is went to sleep again. I think we might actually need two ranchers. 
so that my one sleep in the jobs can actually get done. Because right now what's going to happen is he's going to have to go and chase the alpacas down. Wherever the hell they've wandered off to. Hope to god I haven't lost any of that. That'd suck. That'd suck really bad. I feel like we've had some alpaca wanderage. That's the merchant? The merchant's actually pinched one of my private quarters. That is hilarious. Oh well. <laughs> Fell dose to you, that's the merchant. That's funny. That is the noise for combat. Sound alarm! Who is my engineer? Professions saying engineer's cracker. What I want is I want cracker not to be in a squad. So he can sound the alarm. Oh no, my mother military guy woke up anyway. Send off the signal so that people actually do their jobs instead of running there. And that's a dead ogre. Perfect. None of my guys actually died. Build furniture door, stone door, box site, thank you. Sorted. And someone go and rescue the yaks and the alpacas. Is that Blaine? No, it's Dimp. Where is Blaine and what is he doing? Please don't. No, it's Belgar. That's our knob. That's Meg's as. Population, a sign. Where are you, Blaine? What are you doing? You're stocking items. Why are you stocking items? Why are you not going to collect alpacas and stuff? It's just wool lying all over the shop. Whatever, man. I think we need to. Who else can we make into a. Uh, a rancher. I mean, we kind of need the farmers that we've got. Um, ah, stonemasons. Um, you, undead llama. You can be a rancher. I don't really need one stonemason. I'm a bit worried about this, the fact that there's only like one yak and one llama. Uh, uh, one alpaca rather. We're not gonna... Oh, for Christ's sakes. There's not gonna be um, any major issues with food because we've got 874, but that's annoying, they're fucking expensive. Unfortunately we can't buy any, any wheat, so we're kind of hamstrung on that. Just the fact that we were so screwed for population up until um, up until December, uh, up until the winter. But that's fine. I'm not. I'm not overly worried about that. I mean, we can eat the goblin meat of the things that we kill, um, and that should keep us busy. I mean, I did say that we had too many yaks, but this isn't what I had in mind. What are you, little alpaca? You're gonna be female alpaca. So yeah, I don't know where our ranchers have actually went off to. Probably because there's no food, they can't actually do anything. Uh, how's the old bandage situation going? 38. After a fight with an ogre, that's pretty good. Oh, no. oh yeah, we lost the yak, it's just the alpaca that we've got left. 
It's madness, I tell you. Madness. Eighth day of winter, though, so we are slowly but surely getting through everything. I actually just got to put my phone on silent because I'm sick of people phoning me. Uh, it's uh, uh there we go. <laughs> silent. Um, it was an unknown phone number, so I'm not answering it. That's what happens when you give out your uh, your personal phone number as a work phone number. Because unfortunately I gave my work phone to my brother because he lost his phone. So currently one phone now, which is an issue because people keep phoning me on my personal phone which is fucking annoying. Ah, uh, oh, first world problems eh. How is... Everything's getting done, I mean, there's, there's very little for me to do right now, other than just try and survive and hope that we don't lose all our yaks and things. Um, what's going on up here? What's our, what's our great hall worth? Oh, almost 10 grand, that's pretty fucking good. But as that gets a higher worth, the worst goblins and shit we're going to end up seeing. Uh, but as soon as all of this stuff's made, then I can switch over to making bronze, which will be good. He's making the ogre leather panels. For when we have... Um, enough stuff to make... Uh, to make a militia actually clad in ogre leather. Instead of them running around in like bone and stuff. Because bone is not very good at blocking shots. But I said, as soon as we get the flintlock pistols, we won't even need that. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back into the military and. Actually, these two guys are fully equipped. Do you have your hammer yet, PJ? No, you don't. Someone else probably got it. If it's been made, that is. Oh, possibly not. I mean, yeah, the breastplates haven't been made for everyone yet. I think. Uh, Spaska equipment. Yeah, you've got everything apart from your breastplate. And PJ, have you got everything? On? Yeah, you've got everything apart from your breastplate. So it's just two breastplates that you've made now. But it's actually making, as you can see, they're making the armor plates. So that's four armor plates. I think it's four to make a breastplate. Yeah, it is. So you just need to pad in the leather straps and then that can be made. Perfect. There you go, there's two bits of wheel padding. And, oh, he's going to make the hammer now for Spastica. Or PJ, rather. That must take a lot of bloody copper bars. And... Hammer. Oh, well, hammer head. There we go, now he's taking that down. Do -do -do -do. Do -do -do -do. And there's the two leather straps. They're definitely yak, aren't they? No, oh, they're ogre leather straps. God damn you. Oh well, that'll be a, a slightly ogre one. It shouldn't be, but uh, it will be. <laughs> How are we doing? Eighth day of winter. Eighth day of winter. We just need to survive this winter, and we've run out of yaks and alpacas, unfortunately. I hope that they haven't all run away, because that'll be expensive to get back. <laughs> Like, really expensive to get back. But, you know, we, we... That's just one of the knock-on effects of having such a close survival, you know? Sure, it's unfortunate, but... Shit happens. Do, 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 do. 
The first day of spring should see us some decent amount of nomads. Uh, Alright guys, anyway, thanks a lot for watching and hopefully I'll see you next time. Bye bye.